In this learning tips video for Open Buildings Energy Simulator, we'll take a look at weather data and how to import various weather data file types. Firstly, on the site location for your building, you will have selected continent, country, location, and weather profile in here. So this is all meeting arm data that comes for free with the software. So once you select your location, it automatically pulls it into the weather data manager. So this will be the data used in our calculations. And it goes through all the design conditions in that weather data file. Lists numerical data for each day of the year in this table. You can dig into each day, have a look at the design conditions through the year. And then we scroll down. It also shows handy graphs for different variables for each day of the year again. So it's handy to inspect the weather data and see where highs and lows are throughout the year. So it goes through temperature, radiation, wind speed, wind direction, pressure, and total sky cover. If you wish to import other weather data file types, you can do so here using the import button. You can directly import Energy Plus, SIBZ, ACADS, um, and other weather data file types, um, such as future weather data years and so on. And in this example, importing a design somewhere here, SIBZ data. And we can also import the TRY, test reference year, which is standard averaged year. Once you've imported all the weather files you need, They'll be available for selection in the site um, location properties for your building. So once you've specified the one you wish to use, this will be applied in your calculations. And you can also find it for the annual um, dynamic simulations under the drop down here. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.